Maybe I, I should them. go like this first. Like, okay, I'm gonna do a haul for you guys of all the stones that I purchased. And um, some information on where I bought them and how much they were. Okay, so my first thing that I'm gonna show you guys is this is the address to where I received the pixies from. I found it on Amazon for $28. Total for uh, two after tax and shipping was 63 which is really good price for these they're five grams and usually you pay 55 for these with our local supplier so this is the packaging that comes in but i'll take one out of here i just buy them two at a time they come in a little box and then they come with a little tube and they come in a little container like this so usually you do like a hard gel layer over the nail and then you go to pour these on, but I usually pour it on over a little tray, like one of these. Say you're gonna do your nail. You take your hard gel and you pour it over. Once you pour them into here, you can place your tube into the top so that you can go ahead and pour them back in. Like this. You pour your tube back in. Enter the tube so you're not wasting any since they're so pricey these are the pixies and also they are in the color cute mood okay, i'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys these are all swarovski all the ones i'm gonna show you guys all of these we only purchase swarovski so these are just plain crystal clear and i believe they're in a size seven okay so the website that we purchased all our Swarovskis from is firemountaingems.com. Firemountaingems.com. Okay, so these are just plain crystal clear. And I order these usually in um, three different sizes. So this is seven, and this is a 12. So I order like two of each. On the website, they usually sell them in uh, 12, 36, 144 pieces, or 1,440 pieces. The only colors that I order usually in 1440 pieces is the AB ones, like these, and they'll actually come in envelopes. Okay, these next ones are called Rumbus. And I buy these on Fire Mountain as well. And these ones I buy them in packs of 12. And then I usually just organize my stones in little containers like these. And then we put them into like little section dividers so that we can have our clients look through them easier. And these are in the color AB. These are in the diameter 10 by 6. And they come in 12 packs and it was $7.12 for each pack of 12. And then I just bought some fun colors. These are turquoise in size 9, and it's 144 pieces, and these cost $3.92. This is the gold color I use. It's um, in the color Colorado Topaz, and I buy 5s, 9s, and 12s in this as well. And I usually just go ahead and purchase two of each size, just so I'm not having to order so frequently or having to pay shipping twice. This is the Sunflower SS9 in 144 pieces. These are the Swarovski SS9 Fuchsia in 144 pieces. They're like a darker purpley pink. These are a really popular color as well. These are the Blue Topaz in SS5. I ordered these in three sizes as well. They're still in the package, but this is the color. And then we have some shapes. These are just little stars. They come in six pieces. And these are in the color AB as well. These are an SS9 in cobalt. These are rose SS9, and they come in 144 pieces as well. And I bought two packs of these. The Crystal AB Flames in 
and they're a package of 48 pieces. These are really popular to place as a centerpiece and then just place little diamonds all the way around it. This is SS9 Tanzanite. It's like a light purple finish. Okay. These are the Crystal AB raindrops in size 10 by 2.8. And then I also purchased these in a smaller size. They're the raindrops as well. They're obviously significantly smaller. Let's see if you can stand next to each other. And the smaller ones are in a size 6 by 1.7. And these we buy in packs of 30. And then of course opal is... And then these are our opal. These are really, really popular. And these are in a size 5. We have two packs of size 5. And then this is a 9 and this is a 12. Just so you can see the size difference. I like to purchase uh, when the color is very popular. Um, I like to purchase it in many sizes just so that when we look like, when we do like clustered looks, we can go ahead and put in the variations of sizes and colors. And then we have these little tiny diamond shaped ones that I found online. They're the same shape as the rhombus, but the finish and the cut on top is a little bit different. And these are like super, super tiny. And these come in pieces of 12. And they're an AB finish as well. And then lastly, lastly, these are the teardrops in an AB finish as well. Um, these are a little bit bigger than the ones I usually buy, so I only purchased six just to see what the outcome of the size was since I never had ordered these. So my grand total for these is $249.85, and this order will last me about two weeks. So I'm roughly spending about $600 in stones a, a month. Um, but we use only Swarovski, so it's totally worth the cost. Um, the shine lasts much longer than most other stones, um, such as acrylic stones um, or plastic. We just choose not to use those here. Um, but they send me like a really cool receipt like this. It breaks down everything. They have like this cool um, login system where after you purchase a certain amount of stones, you are able to upgrade memberships with them, such as platinum and gold memberships, um, and then your discount will become a greater amount. Okay, here's something else that we just got. These are the jelly colors from Vetro. We got it in 242, which is a bright yellow, 244, which is a turquoise aqua color, and then 240, which is the Krista red. I have posted about these a bit on my Instagram, but I'll show you guys what they look inside. They're about the size of uh, maybe a silver dollar. This one um, is pretty popular. As you can see, I've had it for about three days. I'm almost halfway done with it. The yellow, and then this is a turquoise. They look a little darker in the pods than what they show um, as far as the true color. This is a red one. Let me show you guys the swatches again. Okay. This is the color, the way it comes out. Um, also keep in mind that the color on here is over a nude base like this one. Another thing that we purchased last week is these three marble tints. So these are the marble tints. And you go ahead and open it. And it's literally just like an ink that you go ahead and dab onto the nail. You haven't seen these? No. <laughs> it's just like a tinted ink that you dab onto the nails and then you use alcohol or acetone. I prefer acetone um, and go ahead and pat onto it and it will give you a look like these. <laughs> so this is the Peridot Green and that is this for this to the left. And then there's the, the Molly Chet. Malichet. Malichet. <laughs> oh, Malichet. This is almost like an emerald green when it goes on, and then as you place acetone on it, it kind of separates into more of a marbled look, a smoky look. And then the last one is burial pink. And that is this one, furthest to the right. 
I really like these because um, they stay very true to their color. Um, as far as when you use, um, we usually, before I purchase these, we would just use um, nail art pens like these. But when you use nail art pens, what happens is um, we would put down the red color. And when we go back in with acetone, the red would turn into the more of a pink color or like a lot of people use sharpies and the sharpie will be black so they'll place the black ink but once they touch it with the acetone the acetone actually makes it turn like a purplish color or a blue and then it's not staying true to its color but these um just kind of since it's just a tint of that pure ink color it kind of just goes into like a spreaded marbled look um instead of being like a diluted version of what the nail polish is Okay, next, another package we received earlier this week is the Zule package. Okay, first and foremost, before I show you guys these glitters, the first thing you need to purchase from her is this Bling Adhesive. This is the best resin I have used. I used resin uh, from Mia Secret, which is this one. I use this one for like three or four years, I swore by it, but this is now my go-to. This glue will make the stones last forever. So if you swear by the Mia Secret, you will absolutely love this resin. So I just received um, three colors from Zule. And they're these three glitters. A yellow and iridescent. And this one is also iridescent, but it has like a purpley blue, silvery feel to it. Um, this one is yellow. It is, um, the name of the yellow is Chingona. She said it's named after herself. <laughs> and the glitters are already mixed in acrylic so as soon as you receive them they're ready to go this one is in daisy which is the iridescent blue purpley silvery one and it comes in a container like this this one's like super popular And then lastly, I have the one in Unicorn. And that one is more of a clear iridescent look. So these are the three Zule. That is what they look like. And of course, you can't forget the resin. The bling adhesive from Zule as well as, well as the glitters. This is also a new color that I received from Mia Secret. The cover nude blush this is my go-to nude now this is what it looks like it's a matte finish um no glitter in it no shimmer and it's like a perfect nude and then for everyone that asks these are the glues that we use not for stones but to glue on the tips um they're the kds glues and i buy a hundred of these for 27 dollars on amazon so these are all the items i received for this week um let me know if there's anything that you guys would like to see a review on or let me know if there's anything that you guys would like me to try and do a review on or anything that you guys just personally haven't purchased that you guys would like to see or anything in the video that you have seen.